question is from Sean Lanier at WCMH in Columbus. Hey, Governor, when it comes to this uh, plot to, you know, possibly do a citizen's arrest on you, is it at all shocking that we're hearing more about this? And are you at all shocked to hear um, that something like this happened in, here in Ohio against you? No, I'm not shocked by it. Uh, at this point in my life, nothing, not much shocks me anymore. Um, you know, it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a sad thing. Again, I don't know any of the details uh, uh, of this. So I'm not going to comment on, on, on the, the facts here. Uh, I've heard the allegation. Uh, but uh, look, we, we, have, we have people uh, in every state uh, who believe that um, they can take the law in their own hands. We have people who believe that uh, the government's illegitimate uh, and that they have every right to go and uh, basically overthrow the government in one, sh one form or the other. I think it's incumbent upon all of us to denounce that uh, and say that's wrong. Whether that's coming from the left, whether it's coming from the right, it doesn't matter where it's coming from. You know, that is, that is wrong. Uh, we have a long, long history of respect for law, um, respect for our democratic process. Uh, our, our history in this country is that we uh, can disagree, we can battle it out. We see that in the legislature. We see that, you know, uh, when they're talking about bills, we see it uh, in Congress. We see it uh, among presidential candidates, candidates for governor. And all that is part of our process, you know, a robust debate, um, tough debate. But we all accept the fact, except a few who are out there, uh, that that's where it ends and that we have elections and elections decide things and we have court cases and they decide things. And there is a process, uh, a wonderful process for us to work things out in this country. And the idea that some people think that they uh, can override what everybody else wants to do, they can take the law in their hands is just despicable and it's wrong. Uh, and again, I'm not commenting about this instant. I don't know the facts, but we are seeing people out there who believe that. And uh, we have an obligation, each one of us as elected officials, opinion leaders, uh, to denounce that and say, that is wrong. It's wrong morally. It's wrong legally. Uh, it's anti-democratic. It's anti-everything this, this country stands for.